The witness could have gotten her information from anywhere. It's even possible that it was spontaneously made <laughs> up inside <laughs> the witness's head. And he lectures me on reckless bab blabbering. As long as we don't know where this information comes from, it's quite a waste of time to focus on this line of questioning. Where did all that get her goddamn info? Maybe it's the newspaper? There has to be something I can use. If it's the fucking camera. Sounds like just another tidbit of gossip. You can't just ignore it though, because ignoring is bad. Well, bad I don't people. think I heard anything out of the ordinary. Ignoring is what bad people do, and also my dad. How much you want to bet it's actually the camera? I really want to say it, though. It's so stupid, but what else do we have? And when I find it, I'm going to press the hell out of it. Which statement? First, should I save? Yeah, go ahead. Because, wait, which statement did you want me to do it on? Didn't we? Wasn't it the last one? Last one? This one? Oh yeah, uh, yeah cause... Save! We can already tell you oh, fuck. another person who does know it. Well, sort of. Sort of, kind of, with the baby on top. Objection! Nope, it's not the camera. Okay. Let's go get Please you! Start. Mr. Wright, Excuse you me, I'm out. gonna go... Eat your camera. You can't eat the camera, though. By which I mean your health points. You By which I mean your soul. You didn't do it, though, because I skipped it before you could do it. I did it off screen. No, you didn't. Okay, now what? I don't know. I play Monster Hunter. I can't do much help. Right Monster Hunter! <laughs> um, Monster Hunter! Gossip. Crime photo. Uh, don't you need hearts? to press first? You need to press before you can present. That's not the rules. Yes, it is. Because it gives you an option here. See? Oh, present evidence. Now present. Oh, okay. So no one else is supposed to know this secret information, correct? No one else! No one at all! No one! No one! Absolutely nobody! Alright, so if that's true, then why do you know it, Miss Old Beth? Actually, you probably should do the camera. For this version. Yes. Why are you looking at me like that? Stop it! I know I'm not like you! I'm sad to say this, but this is how you found out your secret. Isn't it? Take that! The yep. investigative there photographer. Lot of hearts. Oh yeah, I remember that crazy person. She was pretty crazy. And also had this accent. Yo. <laughs> Shut up. She reported that she had lost a certain note she had written to herself. Wait, she reported such a thing? I didn't. Notes are actually of worth. Must be this case. <laughs> Note to self. Yes. <laughs> Note to self. Notes are actually very useful. And also of very significant worth. I must look further into this. One of those things, at least. Go! On that piece of paper, she had written down some of her out... Impressions! About the relationship between the victim and Miss Andrews. Ah, what? Outrageous ideas, you say? No, 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 no. I said impressions. <laughs> and... 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 Ah, that's it! That's the note! Ah! 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 No, 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 no! You see, this is something completely different! This is my top ticket with the groceries to buy! Hmm. Then you are the one who took Miss Hart's note! Uh, uh, I'm a huge head of wands! That's the reason I do everything! That's the reason I get up in the morning! That infamous puppy haired whipper snapper! She's working with the evil in guard! She says so herself! In guard, I'm a psychic! She was so happy, smiling like a silly duck! That was the only chicken what she had written! 
And I would have um, gotten away with it if it, if it weren't for that silly <laughs> lawyer and his pet. <laughs> And his, and his pet assistant. Pet assistant's cousin. <laughs> what? That works. Um, that works. Um. Yeah. Oh, you believe me, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> I was only trying to help out my play angel, I am. There's only a little piece of paper. I didn't, I've never taken anything else before. Didn't she do this in the last case she was in? <laughs> You really should come up with a supply of cheese to match your vintage wine. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes! Well, it was only a piece of paper. Salt. I suppose we can overlook this just once. She looks like she's really sorry for once. Should I forgive her? Nah. Hey, I will give a rude. <laughs> what you have done is If I let up on her now, she'll get away. I have to find some way to inflict the deafening blow to her and the prosecution. Witness! You said that the only thing you stole was that note. Is this correct? Stole? Why don't you listen more carefully, you annoying brat? I pilfered it! I saved this piece of paper! Uh, give me a second. I saved this piece of paper from Terra Terrible Lonely Trash Can, that's all! You're lying, damn it, and I can prove it! Damn, son! This all of a sudden gotten dark. Are you putting my credibility on your screen again? Oh, hell yes I am! Miss Old Bag, I don't believe that the note is the only thing you stole that night. And the camera again. Take that! Miss Old Bag, that note was with a camera inside its case, wasn't it? A camera? A camera. What is that? Camera? A camera? Oh, no, not that! It's too ultimate! <laughs> Yesterday, Lala Hart was raising a huge stink over her camera. She kept saying, like, My sweets! Oh, God. What voice? Random! Help oh, him out! Uh... My sweet, my sweet is $1,600 camera. Disappeared, done gone, disappeared on me. Thank you! What? What? Witness! What is that, Gramps? If you have the note, then it's only logical that you have the camera, too. Looks like you found me out again, Sonny. And I would have gotten away with it too if it wasn't for the things that I said earlier. Yep. Uh, if that weren't for that damn dog in my head. <laughs> there's the camera. What? You don't let the six does he's still a person, you know? I can argue that. I, I can still eat skills like you. I fall in love. I do all these other crazy things as well. But I'm still um, normal. I think your definition of a borrow is a little off. I saw that woman's business card and I knew when I and I noticed it said slime bag celebrity photography extraordinaire. Well, when I saw it, I had to know what sort of pictures she had taken. I'm a professional security guard. It's my business to know these things. Hey, Liv. Check this camera's photos. Hurry! We must examine them at once. <laughs> hmm. Oh, that's some good contrast on these photos. <laughs> um, it's got color and everything. Wow. It's got and everything. <laughs> Well, well, Mr. Edgeworth. It's almost focused, too. What do you think? There is only one photo that seems to be relevant to this case. Can I have the rest, then? If it pleases the judge. Yara! Yeah. Or if it pleases you all. Present it to the courts. That one photo. I get all the others, though. Mine. Come. Precious. <laughs> Come. Th this is the Nicholas Edgeworth. Right? Rich, mine huh? now. Uh, um, something's a bit off there. What, Samurai or the Nickel? But every the Nickel's thing. always off, but... Like, look at the legs. Yeah, what about them? They look, they look weird as usual. Like, they're sagging. Mm -hmm. Like, they're, they're, they're like... Yep. Compare with that, where it's not sagging. Mm -hmm. Sagging, not sagging! There's a difference! Oh, sag, damn it! See, I told you! That's the person I saw! I swear it! 
That proves that the witness was not lying earlier. That about this. Lot of photo. Add it to the court record. Stolen from her killer. Lotta's photo printed out and <laughs> What printed does out. this all mean, Mr. Edgeworth? What's this photo by itself is not proof that the fact that person is the dad that's that fucker. This photo by Take itself it. does not prove that the person in it is offended. However, in his own confession, Mr. Engard clearly stated that at the time of the murder, he was still in his Negro Samurai costume. But if that's the case, then, this Negro Samurai is. <laughs> the defendant. Perfect. How did it come to this? I think this brings us to the end! We've examined- Oh, God. Oy. Uh oh. Sorry about that. We have examined every piece of evidence thoroughly. Final comments, Mr. Wright? The court will consider them before we close. You're all wrong! You're all wrong! I'm the best! Can I- can I say one thing? Sure. No! Okay. Are you done? Yes. Do you agree that this photo is decisive evidence against your client? Nah, this photo really is decisive. Not only are we Don Maya's dad. And also nah, it's indecisive. It but if I raise some chicken here and blow it, then Maya's only going to be dad. Well, she's going to be dead both ways then. I can't make a mistake here. There's only one way out. And it's through bluffing through hell. Bluffing through hell. I bluffed through hell, and I bluffed to hell. Awesome. There's something strange. There's something... There's something strange about this, but I can't quite put my finger, finger on it. it. Maybe because it's scalding hot, but okay, you know what I mean. What are you referencing? Nothing, actually. Are, are you just doing this on your own whim? Yes. On my own whim, as opposed Go. to my will. Yes. There's... There's something weird about this photo. Something a little strange. That's really strange. I knew this was coming right. Your thoughts, Mr. Edgeworth? I think we can all agree there. All, I think we can all agree that uh, there's nothing strange with this photo. There's no way for the defense, the defense to debunk this photo, even the bunker buster and other things. Well, what? I, Iron Man! <laughs> well, I have one! It's in my hands! Actually, it is my hand! <laughs> The bunk with the bunker buster! Is that what you're planning to do, Mr. Wright? Oh my Kill god! Kill us all! If that's the case, we're all getting out of here. That doesn't sound like Man, a bad I idea! I got one better. Hmm. Look at the photo one more time, anyways. If you say so, okay then. Point it out. You only need one chance. Okay, whatever you say. I have to find something wrong now. Where, where, where? You see, oh, this is what happens when you don't prepare for anything. You it's, have to figure things out on the it's fly. It's out of focus. Why can't she take a good shot, even especially when it counts? You were right with the out of focus. Yep. Maybe it's, it's almost like you played this game before. I just remember that her photos are pretty much always out of focus. Now then, let's hear your objection. I object! To all what about these photos? Made by everyone! Cause I'm the best! There. 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 Don't there. mess up. There. Just pick a leg. Here. Don't mess Go. up. Go. Take that! Work. I'd like to direct the court's attention to this one area, right here. What are you pointing to? His ankles? <laughs> his ankles? If you could see this person's ankle, that would be one thing. However, you can't. And what does that mean? It means that the culprit the was right. The nickel this photo was a fake. Yep. It was all a setup. It was what a... is the meaning of this? It was all a corgi. A corgi? No one. No, you didn't get it. All a corgi to plan? <laughs> That's actually pretty good. <laughs> I wonder Go. if you would care to elaborate with actual facts, that is. Let's take a look at the Nickel Samurai poster. Okay, we're looking at it, Mr. Wright, and we see nothing of importance. Look at his legs, and more specifically, where his, his feet are. And more specifically, his legs. 
Look, look at his feet. Edgeworth, look at the goddamn feet! I'm looking. You don't have to tell me, Mr. His... His socks! They're sock-like! You can see them! Exactly! Like. However, in this They're photo... Not... You can't! He has to hold up the thing just to walk! Uh, oh, it's a... What? There's only one explanation. The person know. inside this costume is much shorter than the defendant. Yes, we agree. Yes, I agree. Because... All right, I think I, I think I've done a turnabout here. Let's, let's get this going. All right, now for. Uh oh. Uh oh. Curious. Huh? What? That's so curious. This is because he already knew. <laughs> Damn it, Edgeworth, why are you so genre savvy? What did you learn? Because he's our partner in not in uncrime. In, uh, in uncrime. Our partner in justice. In crime solving. Our partner in justice. Yes. In justice we trust. What one of these our two partner in finding the truth. What these two people said, because the only thing that's running through my mind now is crime. Yes. That's true. Crying? <laughs> yes, that's true. Along for the ride. What do you mean? Oh, that's no good. He He's not taking any damage. He's I'm not, not taking the weak damage. spot. <laughs> Where's the weak spot then? You flip. So here we have. Clearly, he must not have a soul. Is he secretly a ginger? So <laughs> no. we have we have <laughs> this giant emery crab. You flip it over and then attack its weak spot for massive <laughs> damage. Mr. Edgeworth, where does this leave us? Leaves us with red herring. If the person is not Madame Guard. Everything a bus can is tried to prove is worthless! Hop top hop top hop top hop top hop top hop top Hmm, I thought it would come to this. What? 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 <laughs> hey, I can right. do it too. <laughs> I have something I want to ask you. Okay. I think you have proven that this person is inside this costume is not Matt and Guard. In that case, who is this a photo of? Uh, oh my god, secrets! Who's the person wearing the costume? Isn't it obvious? I'm gonna stress out so much. Yeah, why is he so calm? It must be Edgeworth. <laughs> it must be the judge. Mr. Wright, let's hear your thoughts. Who is this person in the autograph? In the autograph. Photograph. Save. Photograph. Can't save. Can't save. I can push all the buttons and it won't work. Uh, well, we know who it is because of our massive minds. Yes. The security lady? Must be double A. <sighs> I said massive minds, not your tiny one. Use your massive one. I don't have one. Then find one or steal it from someone I else. I can't steal. Ask him. If I stole, I'd be in jail. Haven't you ever had Dr. Frankenstein ask you to go to the brain bank, brain bank and get you a good brain? No. <sighs> Take that! It's these days. Uh, Adrian Andrews! Adrian Andrews is actually a murderer? Whoa. Gossip. Gossip. Oh. I bet my gossip journal will love reading this. Your gossip journal would love reading this. Yes. <laughs> you know, I, I don't you know it's become an uh, you know an animate object. I want to be a real boy now. Like, and by the way, what I just said makes no sense at all. We because the judge is and we didn't tr and we didn't attempt to tr try to probably fix because it. the judge is so mortal. He might be suffering from hysteria, or you know, Alzheimer's. <laughs> <laughs> I bet it's a combo of the two. Alzheimer's is the fact that he can't remember. The hysteria is him hallucinating. So that means he can't Amended remember his so that hysteria. Means he can't, so that means he can't remember his hysterics. There you go. For as long as I can remember, I have always been a judge, even when I was born. Even when you <sighs> judge, baby. Yes. If you wish to know who that Nicholas Samurai is, it is none other than this woman. 
And why would you say it would be Miss Adrian Andrews? What in the world points her to you, or points you to her, or points every anyone to everyone? <laughs> Mr. Andrews, you're not making sense. For starters, she's short! And she can freely move in and out of Mr. Ungard's room. Finally, she had dinner with Mr. Ungard that night. Okay, how does that add up? I'm no good at this. I'm not good at math. I didn't even graduate through math. It means that it makes it very easy for her to get a certain item. A certain knife with a certain Mr. Mattingard's fingerprints all over this certain item. What is this now? A certain... Yes. A certain... The... certain magical... I can't... Scientific... A certain knife gonna... that was used as a certain murder weapon! There's something at the tip of my tongue, but I can't seem to remember it. Certain alchemical process? There you go. Why don't you just say what it is you wanted to say, Mr. Wright? I have to do this. There is nowhere, there is nowhere else to go. The culprit was head herring! The, the defense motion is to indict Miss Adrian Andrews in the murder of Juan Cordida. It was Miss Andrews who tried to frame the defendant for the crime. Oh no! Oh my god, why? It looks like this trial has a strange, crazy development again. This trial has escalated to new and my, my throat's actually starting to hurt again. Wow. You didn't even, you didn't, you didn't even have to become an old, an old, old hysterical old lady. Mr. Edgeworth! Yes, sure. It's because I do things like that with randomly raising my voice. And yeah, also but, the gravelly voice that the but judge I'm has. I'm a crazy old lady. But the the judge... gravelly voice? Gravelly. Gavel? Gavel. No. The gravelly voice? No, there's no <laughs> gavel. Just gravelly. Got a gavel in your throat? Ugh. This woman is just doing herself pain up for Miss Adrian Andrews. A verdict cannot be passed without first hearing her side of the story. Really? Bullshit. How boring. Alright, that's obviously what Edgeworth said now. Oh, All right. oh shit. <laughs> Damn it, Monster Hunter, why are you so much more interesting? This it is, mate, this is potentially awful. It eh? What do you mean? I mean, the trial could oh. last forever. Oh, wait. Oh, that's no yep. good. We had to get it today. Right. Not the next day. We must do it today. <laughs> oh, I see what you One did more... there, my friend. Oh, crap! If I don't get a verdict today, then Maya's dead! Tomorrow, or the day after, or the day no, after that. We shall send Miss Andrew's testimony for tomorrow. What am I supposed to do? The judge is about to adjourn the court! Objection! Now then. Objection! God damn it. Ugh. <coughs> Please, Your Honor, continue the trial. You must pass the verdict today. Uh, no, Mr. Wright, I'm not doing that. We cannot hear... All that. Or we can. I abhor wasting such valuable time. Edgeworth? See, he's your partner in finding the truth. <laughs> your Honor, I request that you please continue with today's trial. But... We cannot continue due to this! <sighs> Unexpected. <laughs> I think you underestimate me, Your Honor. And what do you mean by that? Uh, Mr. Phoenix Wright would slave his way to subpoenaing Miss Adrian Andrews as well. Happening according to plan, even if Wright was a bit slow to catch on. <laughs> what? We like Ed we like Edward better. Yeah, he's the best. Man, why does everyone hate me? Is a cousin Phoenix Wright? Who's that guy? I don't know, but his hairstyle looks weird. I'm Cory Bartol. <laughs> what the fuck? That was out of nowhere and at the same time expected. Yeah. It's it somehow catches the audience. What would the audience say if he just yells that out of nowhere? Who the hell's Cory Bartol? Has this guy gotten delusional? Damn it. Damn. What is the meaning of this, Mr. Re Mr. Edgeworth? Mr. Redworth. 
Mr. Rector. Red Trick. Ugh, nice. Miss Adrian Andrews is currently waiting in the prosecution hall. She is the next witness. Oh, crap. Everything was planned. It was all a ruse. It was a setup. <laughs> Somehow I knew it. Because I'm the best. I'm the best. No one else. Just me. Only me. I'm the best. Exactly. <laughs> Very well. Call the next witness. However, before we proceed, ten minute recess. Yeah, recess. Prepare your witness in that time, Mr. Edgeworth. Yeah, for preparation. What are you, Pearl? Ten minute recess. Go. Are we done for today? Probably. Besides, my throat needs to take a slight rest. Yeah. Are you trying to find a thing? So, this and is... now, Redacted is about to eat the typewriter. So this is our own kid. <laughs> the typewriter. Who are you? I'm the typewriter. You are not the typewriter, though, because you're still here. Tasty! <laughs> I think you might be random today. But it's gone now. Signing out.